Third baseman on high alert right now, looking at a bunt situation. That's down low. Sorencioni's going, and she's in easily with the stolen base. He probably saw Lydia's catch on that line drive that she laid out for among the top 10 plays of the day. Getting some national and international acclaim, and she's got this one in the gap. It's going to score a run for sure. Coble's got it down. She'll turn and make second easily. Coming across is Sorencioni. And the Lakers' big run producer, Lydia Goble, does it again. Get Popko to chase. She hits one in the air to left field, coming hard and making the catch is Hollister. Another web gem for the Lakers to get out of the third. Playing for the team in red and white today. Beatis gets her to swing and miss at the changeup for strike three. Grass in one of the power alleys. She's looking. Island's going. Island is in there with a head first slide. That we did not see coming. Full count. In the air toward left center field. Coming out again. What a catch. It is Hannah Hollister with her second diving put out in this game. Interesting split grip for this hitter. Is a smash up the middle that'll be a base hit. So the player they call Holly rips one by the shortstop, Sarah Gersh into short center field. And now Grand Valley has an opportunity. Runner is going, ball down to second. It's into the outfield. Hollister, ooh. Just wants to put it in play on the right side if she can. And there is a changeup, strike three. And what a reaction from Wagner there. In the air on in the infield, Spicer coming hard. Oh my goodness, another diving Laker catch. And Grand Valley is out of trouble once again. Perhaps not. It's a bunt up in the air. Oh, it's a good one. They're not going to get a play on it. It's a ground ball on the left side. It's in the left field. And the bases are loaded now with one out. And Dana Kelly handed the stop sign on for Spicer. Dugout, let's see what happens here. In the air, and it's in the center field. It'll score a run, maybe two. Here comes Island. The throw to the plate will not be in time. It's a two-run single, and Grand Valley breaks it open. Three-nothing Lakers on the base hit by Joanna Sorincioni. Gold ball into center field. This one should score two. The runners are moving. Popko with the throw in. It's another double for Goble on the first pitch. The Lakers with two more. And Grand Valley now with a handful for Hannah Beatis. In the air to right field. Let's see if a play is on. Grand Valley is going to try to score the runner from third, and they will do it. It is Hollister who comes home. Goble moves to third. It's six up on the board now for Grand Valley. That was up and past Gills for a strikeout and two out now here in the bottom of the seventh. And there's number 11. Boy, she's been doing it for years. If one in relief can be at us, finish it off right now. On the ground, well, a play by Camaris. Reach out and speared that one, and it's another flawless defensive performance by Grand Valley. And some timely hitting in the seventh inning. Gives the Lakers a spot in tomorrow's championship series. Somebody's going to have to beat them twice.